Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is going to be a general collective reading, so please remember to take what resonates. Leave the rest. Okay? Okay. Let's see what's going on here. Okay. Three of Wands. Four of Wands. Somebody stuck in the house. Eight of Swords. Huh. So, whosever energy I'm picking up on right now. I'm not sure if I should do this reading. Because I feel like this fire truck is very significant here. The three and four of wands. It's like somebody made an offer here on a home. And I feel like somebody refused to take it. And they're not budging. All right. is kind of okay yeah queen of cups is the challenge here the eight of swords and the moon something is hidden about this home and this queen of cups this person who is who is in the home cancer pisces scorpio energy this is pisces and cancer what is the most recent past? What is the most recent past? Ten of Cups. So somebody got everything that they wished for. An offer. And an Ace of Pentacles. So, I feel like somebody offered somebody something for a home here. And because they didn't budge, it was, it was what they wanted. They, they didn't care if they were stuck in it or not they didn't want to give it up okay so the immediate future is the magic of this empress a matriarch and a star so there's more than one feminine here Libra, Taurus, Virgo, Gemini, and a mother figure. They could be one and the same, the Empress and the mother figure. Or this could be somebody torn between a mother figure and their significant other. Like I said, this is an offer of some kind of home, some kind of healing. And for some reason, this fire truck is sticking out to me like, like there's, there's an emergency for this Queen of Cups. This could be somebody's mother, maybe somebody who's got some kind of fame. Six of Pentacles as the factor affecting the situation, somebody's success, somebody's peace, just laying on the side there. Abundance in the sun. This is a beautiful reading. But there's some kind of exposure coming out about this empress who has magic, who has a star quality to them and a mother figure that possibly is undergoing some kind of emergency. We'll get more information. There's a lot of abundance here in the sun, which is total happiness, total wish fulfillment. This is like everything that somebody could wish for. Outside influence is the five of wands and the nine of wands. And 
and an emperor using their intuition. They're hurt. So this emergency could be a mother that's in bad shape. And perhaps this mother is telling this emperor to follow their intuition. And even though I feel like she might be fighting, there's so much competition on the outside here for this emperor. This mother energy is telling this emperor to use their intuition when it comes to the four of wands. Relationship, wish fulfillment, everything they could ever want. That this empress is magical. And in the immediate future, whoever this five of, five of wands, nine of wands is, this is somebody who was wrestling with the idea of the emperor and the empress being together. But now they're standing in their integrity. And telling this emperor to use their intuition. Whatever that means. It has something to do with the four of wands. Marriage, home. Uh, perhaps, like I said, maybe this matriarch or this mother energy was not happy about the two of them. But is having some sort of change of heart because of an emergency. Okay, so... Extra, extra, read all about it. Uh, Page of Wands is sending a message about work. To possibly a Pisces. To try to hold them up from moving forward. Well, this has gotten interesting. Final outcome, the Hierophant, a belief system, a marriage. Ooh, somebody's about to get surprised. Surprise, surprise, surprise. Big surprise, Scorpio energy. This was a belief system of somebody else's energy that has now come to a, a different belief about marriage, about home. Between an emperor and an empress. To where they might have gotten in the way before. They're telling this emperor to make an offer. I think this emperor, whoever they are, this masculine energy is quite shocked by the surprise here. That everything that they were told about this empress was a lie. It was all about the money. It was this Ace of Cups the whole time. And his Knight of Pentacles lied about this energy. Perhaps told the Emperor that, that maybe this Empress put a spell on them or something. Like I said, this Emperor is experiencing justice in, in, some, in, in, in a way, in a really, really strange way. Knight of Cups wants to call a truce because justice is being served to this emperor who is experiencing an ending Scorpio energy and we have Virgo energy with the hermit hiding things trying to work things out with a star or is a star with a queen of wands Somebody who possibly had to defend themselves against the ghost, against whatever this belief system was. Now the tower comes in and the card, the house of cards falls. Because of whatever this emergency is. Like I said, I am seeing a literal fire truck here. I mean, maybe not just on the cards, but... Um, 
Eight of Swords, Five of Five of Pentacles. Somebody seriously regrets getting in the way of this. They regret stopping a person or blocking a person from making an offer. I have no idea who that is. I have to call back. They were trying to stop this person from making an offer. They regret it now. Re making an offer of the four of pentacle or the four of wands and the ten of pentacles to possibly a queen of cups, or this is the queen of cups. Like I said, I do feel like there's a mother energy that was involved in blocking someone or keeping someone from seeing something. Now they regret it because they're facing an emergency or karma or something of that nature that is causing a tower. Queen of Cups already walked away. Okay? So, whatever was blocked here, Queen of Cups, Empress, I can't make it up. This person considered it a loss. You know? They did cups it. They didn't they didn't they were just like, you know what, this ain't worth it. And they didn't stick around. They didn't wait for nobody. They knew they were being being blocked. Their intuition was spot on. They knew that they were being blocked. They were a loving, kind being, very nurturing, very caring, was willing to offer everything wish fulfillment to this masculine. But the Eight of Swords was there. And then this Queen of Cups, Empress, just said, you know what? Screw it. Whatever. If it's that important to you, keep it. I gotta go. Eight of Cups. And I feel like, I feel like that's you, viewer. I feel like you walked away from this because you didn't want anything to do with it. Yeah. So the challenge is for this person to make an offer after, after you've walked away. To make some kind of offer. Page of Pentacles, Eight of Wands. To contact you. To call you. To get in touch with you. To walk away from something that has them so stuck in their head and regretful. I feel like for the way that they treated you. Karma's a bitch. Yeah. So, somebody saw this Ten of Cups as some kind of illusion. Didn't believe that, didn't believe this Queen of Cups was an Empress. Didn't believe the strength of this Empress. Didn't believe in them at all. It was their Ten of Cups. It was their destiny. And the illusion was stronger here than the offer of love. For an emperor and a queen of wands. Somebody has to walk away here. Because it, it was all like a pie in the sky type energy. It felt like the ten of cups. But what was the ten of cups was walked away from. Because somebody was under some kind of illusion here. Flying monkeys and stuff. Look who it is behind the Queen of Wands. Obsessed much? I'm just saying. You know, Emperor, the Devil, and the Queen of Wands. So this... This was definitely a missed opportunity for somebody with an Empress. A magical Empress at that. So... 
Somebody's trying to fix it. Immediate future. I think whoever you are, you're going to be real surprised because here it comes. It coming back around again to, for the cycle to be closed with this Queen of Cups. Because somebody, somebody cost them something here. Somebody caused some kind of problem in their life. Or is still trying to cause them a problem. Some kind of magic trick. Yeah. I'm feeling third party energy with this emperor. Yep. Third party energy. Sending a message of an offer. It's magically delicious. So whoever this third party is is here, the, the, the cycle is being closed with them. A cycle is coming to a close with them and opening up a door for a Queen of Cups. Some sort of magic trick, some sort of magic that this person pretended to have that belonged to an empress. And an emperor, masculine and feminine. This third party has to give up. They have to close out a cycle. I feel like they, they kept somebody juggling. They're still trying to keep them juggling, trying to keep them confused. The two of swords. Because this, I feel like this masculine just wants peace. But what they're getting is a magic trick. And I feel like I feel like this masculine may think that this Queen of Cups put some kind of hex on them, spell on them, something like that. Maybe that that was a lie. Maybe that was what was lied about. Cause it's Queen of Cups ain't got no time for that. Nah, she she got the magic on her. She ain't gotta do no magic trick. Alright. So the past, not returning, but this ain't over. Longest days of the week, and night, uh, night of Pentacles takes the most time. Did not want it. Didn't see the blessing in it, or the success behind it, or the peace behind it, because there was an attraction issue. Now, I can't say that for the rest of you, but if I if I can't kiss it, I can't be with it. It's just pretty simple. But I do feel like there was there's no attraction here. But there is some kind of union taking place. Third party has been put in their place. Five of Wands, Nine of Wands. Somebody seeing the absolute truth about a Queen of Cups. And they can't move on from it. They don't want the past to be over. They don't want Ten Swords in the in the back of the, the Empress or the, or the Queen of Cups. However, the truth is coming out about all of it. I'm getting some weird vibes here, guys. Yeah, confusion. So that was that was the whole the whole deal here. Was that somebody had this emperor confused, competing with confusion, getting paid for a five of swords, five of wands. Getting paid to fight somebody who wasn't even wasn't even in the same realm as getting paid to fight an empress who's just staying in her own lane and doing her own magic, and they're doing magic on her because they're confused about who the fuck she is. Y'all need to figure it out and stop it. Stop it. 
Because this Queen of Cups does not want anything to do with this. I can tell you that much right now. Stop this nonsense. You will pay the price. Which is extra, extra read all about it. And possibly an ambulance or a fire truck. Because whatever magic spell you try to put on this empress or, or think the empress has put on you or whatever she ain't got no time for that therefore you are fighting a losing battle before you even get started five of swords six of pentacles what's fair is fair and even though the devil is a liar he's, a, he's usually fair because if you put your foot in it it gonna smell all right I'm just saying, you know, if you st if you continue this kind of behavior towards a peaceful, loving, kind being, you will pay the price. God will make sure, and I'm sorry, but I do believe in God, and I do believe in karma, and, and because I'll tell you what, every time I've ever done somebody wrong, I pay for it, and you will too. Whoever you are. Three of Wands. Ten of Cups. The door is almost closed on this. Nine of Wands. Ten of Wands. Somebody's ready to throw this Ten of Cups away. They're tired. They're tired of carrying the load for this entire family. Because this, 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 these people think the grass is greener on the other side. They're tired. This empress could be a mother figure. She's tired. The confusion about a ten of pentacles and a hierophant. A belief system about money. Money is not the one all be all. The Ten of Cups is. You can't buy that. Somebody's about to lose it forever. They might want to count their blessings while they still have them. Like I said, somebody's facing an ending here. And I feel like somebody's very sorry for what they've done. But they're not going to be able to make up for it if they continue this this Ten of Wands, Nine of Wands, Two of Swords, Five of Wands. Yeah. And make a Ten of Cups wait. Because that Ten of Cups ain't going to wait. Whoever you are, you better make that offer. You need to make that offer to that Queen of Cups. Because she ain't going to wait for you no more. She's going to walk away from the whole thing and wash your hands of it. She tired. She just wants to be left alone. In peace. And in truth. No longer attracted to something here because of what's been done. But I feel like somebody's just finding out about it, this whole thing. They're just finding out about it. Yep. Here's the lie coming out. Seven of Swords. Extra, extra, read all about it. The lie is being exposed by a queen of swords. The truth and nothing but the truth, so help you, you. About an, some sort of alcoholism. There, there is there's somebody who, here who, I don't know what, it, what, what this is, but this is somebody who, like, indulges a little too much in the finer things in life, and I feel like indulges in the finer things in life, like, ten thousand dollar bottles of wine uh I, i'm just i don't know what this is but it has something to do with a luxurious life while this ace of cups is sitting here in the five of pentacles and the five of swords really is that all you see is the ten of pentacles queen of pentacles that's all you see it's all about the money for you, huh? You might have cost a masculine a very significant happiness. 
with a divine feminine. With somebody who could have brought the magic home and just been everything that this masculine would have wanted. An ace of cups. You stuck it in between the five of swords and the five of pentacles. Really? Wow. Because of a lie? Because nobody did their homework? They just went with a lie? Well, that lie is about to come out and everybody's going to know about it, including this masculine. Have they lost their chance? Well, there's a damn good chance of that. They, they, I feel like they got themselves all involved with some other thing. Just this chariot and the sun in reverse. Somebody's about to make a really bad mistake. And I feel like they're being forced into it. Whoever this karmic or this other energy is, this third party is, they got some dirt on this masculine. Big dirt. And they're threatening to expose them if they don't marry them. Yep. Whoever you are, you do have a choice. And if it's a Queen of Cups or an Empress, they will understand. They will look at this and they, they will not be disgusted by it. They will look at it as karma but like I said whoever you are masculine you about to lose out on the love of your life because you're getting ready to choose somebody that's not for you could be same same gender just saying Maybe they weren't at one time, and maybe they are, were, may, to each his own, you know, y'all do you, I, I, I got no judgment here, I'm doing a tarot reading, but I'm getting a, I'm getting a name, and it's a man's name that was turned into a female's name because they had some kind of change done. Whatever that was. So I don't know what that is, guys. You know, you take it as it resonates. I, I, like I said, that's only going to be for a few of you. Get him a masculine, a masculine's name that's been turned into a feminine's name. What is this magician twice in the immediate future? The truth. Someone's investment didn't pay off. Now they can't move forward. You're stuck with a demon. And a super hardcore betrayal because this demon's fixing to tell everybody their secrets. Including maybe what I just said. I'm just, I'm just gonna get, I'm just gonna be a hundred with you guys. Alright. I'm gonna post this on my regular channel probably and, uh, uh you know, post it on both channels because... I feel like it needs to be heard by one and all. There's things here that have been manipulated and not and are not as they seem to be. Whew. 
four cups in reverse, the fool in reverse, the judgment in reverse, and the nine of or the the Queen of Pentacles upright. Like I said, this mother misjudged an empress. Now this this masculine regrets everything that they did because they were lied to. And it's gonna come all out in the open, even if there's like a, a same sex relationship here or something. All of it's gonna come out in the open. Because justice is going to be had one way or another. Y'all came up against an empress who was just minding the business, loving people. You regret it now, don't you? You're going to. If you don't regret it yet, you're going to. I'm just saying. Wow. What a reading. Beautiful energy, though. I mean, especially for this empress. You know, she's she's doing her. She's blocking anything that isn't true, you know. And whether it's being said about her or to her, she's just blocking it. She don't want anything to do with it. Eight of Cups in that ass. Finding the true self, discovery, and purpose. Like I said, this person may be finding out a day late and a dollar shy. The, the, their Ten of Cups was right there, and they decided to decide with somebody who was creating injustices and unfairness and yeah trying to trap you so you can't see your own divinity social pressure you barreled through it like a bull in a china shop unstoppable no brakes pushing forward no matter what hidden camera hidden wi-fi body snatcher doppelganger stealing your identity or maybe just your energy Misfortune going backwards, hate, gluttony going too far, and losing their divine essence. Same shit, different day. Failed at destroying this empress. And if you haven't failed at it yet, body snatcher doppelganger, oh, that's coming. The tower is coming for you and your lies will be exposed because this person was a ten of cups and y'all threw your own ten of cups away I can't nobody help you when you do that can't nobody help you you're gonna have to face the music on that one not saying that the, you know I mean there's still hope here if you're wise enough to reach for it. If not, you know, good luck with the tower. Because it's a con. It's going to come fast. Somebody's holding their light in solitude. Even if they've been hurt. There's been a lot of mental conflict over a heart chakra activation here. Somebody's not going to see this coming. It's going to be quite shocking. Shocking. But like I said, there's some kind of confession happening here. It could be on somebody's deathbed. It could be like on a matriarch's deathbed. Making a confession to a son or a daughter of what they, of what they left behind for some body snatcher doppelganger. Great fortune, gift, ah, distant horizons, unexpected income, sudden wealth, official notification here, and an expectation of a mature man, 1117. Two 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 six, two 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 seven, and two 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 eight in unison. The path to greatness is what I'm hearing. Somebody just threw it away, but they don't want it to be over. 
because they know that they're not going to be able to ascend or transform some kind of relationship is over here yeah there's no talking there's no nothing and someone is running from a codependent relationship they got what they needed and they left you know a mad black woman type energy there where hey, you slut took all her stuff and some of your stuff and she left in fact she cleaned out your bank account too poor thing oh my gosh so hmm Alrighty then. Let's get some advice. Freedom, freedom, oh freedom. Da, 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 da. Think about it. What you trying to do to me? Oh, think. Gonna let yourself be free. I think this I think this empress, whoever she is, is finally gonna be free of all this messy mess. That's all she wanted anyway. I can tell you that much right now. Alright, this is the cliff swallow. This is the swallow fly, f flies free on the wind currents of the thermals in remarkable aerial maneuvers. Igniting the expression as free as a bird. I'm as free as a bird now. How about you? <laughs> Empress, you're free. Woo! -hoo! In many cultures, such as that of the ancient Egyptians, the swallow was thought to carry souls to heaven. Early sailors would tattoo themselves with an image of the swallow, so if they drowned, the swallow would carry their soul to the heavens. In poor light, a, quist, a cliff swallow looks brownish gray. However, it's in good lighting, it is luminous, metallic, dark blue. Cliff swallows traditionally make their nests on vertical cliffs, carefully crafting them out of mud. Although they can nest solitarily, they usually nest in colonies. When one finds a cloud of insects, it alerts the other members of the flock so that all can be nourished. Even though they fly free, their community supports them. The sacred landscape wants you to know that express yourself without hesitation. Break free and let your spirit fly. Make choices that increase your freedom. Don't be tied down. Laugh, dance, explore, and go beyond the predictable behavior. Be daring. Cast aside restrictions. Find the wings. As you do, you'll help others find theirs. You aren't here to be an ordinary to be ordinary or live a mundane life. You are here to step beyond limitations and self imposed boundaries. Don't be trapped by the com convention or the need to please others. Choose life on your terms and don't accept rules that don't feel right. You can be immensely free and yet still be part of a loving, supportive community you're free of this karmic wheel do with it as you want but you have it feels like a very loving magical energy around you you aren't meant to be normal show off your wings and fly free as a bird you are not obligated to anything anymore. Someone chose something else 
instead of you. And they lost their ten of cups. Go see your messages, my babies. Please remember to press the like button, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.